just split this down with the Havilah's bush tool. The idea is to do a partial split and I lash this, probably trim some of that down, but we could cut that to size and actually have a full sized grip on. This is a little bit bigger lengthwise than an Altoids 10. Again, that's going to require a little bit of thinning, but I can lash that in. So, both these knives so far have been very controllable. Doing partial splits into wood. That was both with uh, more of that cottonwood, the cedar and juniper that I've got sitting here are really dry and just seem to want to split all the way through on one or two strikes, but let's try and do one anyway. This is the, I don't even remember what knife this is, Hillcraft from Tops. Again, I can lash that in and trim it down for a full-sized handle. Um, all three of these knives are pretty phenomenal bushcraft knives from what I've been able to figure out so far. Um, and I honestly think I would be happy with any one of them from this giveaway, but overall I'll put them in order of what I prefer. Number one, number two, number three, just for overall performance, ergonomics, and the way they've worked for me so far. 